Hi, my name is Lex Diaz, and I'm currently enrolled in Full Sail University's film program. My interviewee is Tom Petrovsky, a fellow film student. So Tom, what do you see as the role of visual arts in our mass-mediated world, and particularly in your profession? The visual arts will eventually take the world over, as it's in practically every single commercial, movie, web page, and ad thrown on all the communication gateways of our generation. It does show incredible feats that the human mind can achieve and delivers a promising message to all aspiring filmmakers around the globe. The visual arts play a huge role in present-day entertainment and offers a different look into a simple idea such as how Batman changed from a comic into a television show, then movie, and then revamped with over-the-top special and visual effects via explosions, vehicles, and stunts. As our audience and viewers see more and more new effects, they expect out of future filmmakers much more each year. With new communications and media technologies, imagery is almost instantly available. Do you believe that this is having a negative or positive influence on the industry? Honestly, communication and media technologies through imagery has a major impact on any age group, especially easily accessible social networks like Facebook and YouTube. One simple click and you're thrown into an opinionated internet highway full of memes with a picture of someone or something and another person's opinion about what that person in the picture is thinking. Our industry is affected by this based on average people having the knowledge to use Photoshop, After Effects, Avid, or Final Cut, taking away the true reasons for their purpose, such as making incredible films and photos for employers. Yet, it shows potential in random people and what they are capable of achieving by having the correct mind frame. For example, by filming the YouTube viral Epic Meal Time, people see drunken cooks make extremely huge amounts of food and eat it whole. But they do teach us anyone can operate a camera, edit, and with a simple idea, create someone millions of views that people can enjoy. What popular images do you see that are frequently rechanneled throughout the entertainment industry? Popular images that are recreated would be the large text put into trailers stating how popular magazines and newspaper articles and critics feel about that movie, reality show, sitcom, or album within commercials advertising their product. Another would be the use of visual effects about a product, such as Five Gum and how it stimulates your senses, and how it does that by showing an actor being propelled through a cage in a ball, such as an astronaut would train. Yet this is just an overly radical feeling the taste of the gum could possibly intensely engulf your mouth with. This idea was used in movies like The Simpsons and Idiocracy, and probably many more in the past just recreated. Are there particular images that the industry has popularized or created? Mainly, this industry has made a product more than it seems, using an over-the-top style to grasp the average individual's mind and force them to get the product to feel the same way the actor does. By this, movie stars and well-known artists can be given endorsements to show off a, a popular product such as Clinique, L'Oreal, or CoverGirl to grab the attention of a woman watching that commercial, trying to tell the viewer, get this product and you too can look like Beyonce. Who is one of your favorite visual artists or favorite style of visual art? John Tolles is by far one of the greatest cinematographers I've ever seen and had the chance to fully comprehend his work. He perfectly worked in Tropic Thunder, It's Complicated, Breaking Bad, and my favorite, Braveheart, proving he could work in any genre under any conditions and still show to the commercial world a crafty image of that period in time or emotions conflicting with another. Braveheart, set in medieval times Ireland, was shot from all perspectives a filmmaker and fan of that time would enjoy. For example, the scene when Mel Gibson is slowly trotting uphill towards the leader who killed his wife. He is moved from right to center and then left, flame, left frame as a guard approaches to his horse on the left side before he gets killed by Gibson. Towards the end, when he is beheaded, there are multiple shots directed overhead and a medium shot of Gibson lying on the torture table, immersing the viewer into the movie as if they were one of the peasants witnessing this horrific event. How has your knowledge of famous artworks influenced your creative process? Every aspiring filmmaker has some form of inspiration that alters their creative personality towards anything. But looking at all these films and their creators past, present, and in production works shows us that anything you could dream up is 100% possible and properly could be re represented on camera. Every position on set is important in their own ways and a huge necessity within every production. You're only as strong as your weakest link, and the team I've been working with and the more people I meet in the near future will propel myself into the correct direction to reach each and every goal I've set.